dear professional friends in this video i am going to discuss about how to merge your various pf accounts with your uan account one employee one epf account will help you to withdraw your pf amount after retirement claim your pension amount without employer's intervention why you have to merge your pf accounts with the uan you might have worked in different organization and your pf may lie in different pf offices across india unless you merge the same with your uan account it is very difficult to get all the consolidated pf credits at the time of your retirement and get pension benefits for you and your family for example i worked in various companies and i have withdrawn pf amount from earlier employer when i resigned from them but i have failed to transfer those services to my last employer pf account as such i am not able to get the pension benefits till date and i am struggling with the concerned pf office for the last 2 years one employee one epf account employee provident fund organization e epfo has brought a new facility to help employees consolidate their funds in their old employee provident fund epf accounts by linking them with the one universal account number uan one employee one epf account the service is now available on the epfo service portal under employee services it can be availed of for merging the as many as 10 old pf accounts under under one uan how to merge two or more epfo accounts multiple job changes typically result in multiple employee provident fund epf accounts being opened one with each employer with the introduction of uan universal account number it is possible to consolidate multiple accounts into one single account for each epfo member uan activation each epfo member is allotted a uan which is usually specified on the salary slip to activate uan the member should visit the epfo unified member portal at https unified portal mem epf india dot government dot in member interface and click on the tab activate uan by entering uan name date of birth and mobile number and authorization pin will be generated the uan gets activated once this pin is entered and authentic merging account to merge two existing epfo accounts the member must visit epfo website and uh, and under the services tab you have to click one employee one epf account button details on clicking the link a form will open for consolidating multiple epf accounts the member must enter his mobile number registered on the uan portal next uan current member to must uan and current member id must be entered on submission of these details an otp will be sent to the registered mobile member for authentication merging of accounts on entering the otp the page for entering the old pf account details for merger will be displayed once the old pf account number is entered and the declaration is accepted and submitted the request for merger of that account to the existing pf account will be sent to epfo why you have to link your uan with aadhar the aadhar and uan linking would be would give you following benefits you can apply for epf withdrawal directly to the epfo the employer would not any role here there would be automatic epf transfer you don't even need to apply you can apply for epf pension withdrawal from uan member portal itself there would not be any discrepancy on personal detail the employer can't em- delay the approval of aadhar as you have seen that to link aadhar and uan your mobile number should be the same in both the database hence now you ha- you should think uh, twice before changing the mobile number it is always better to use mobile number portability instead of adopting a new mobile number requirement to link epf accounts with uan number uan number 
கரண்ட் இபிஎஃப் அக்கௌண்ட் நம்பர் லிங்க்டு வித் யூஏஎன் நம்பர் கேஒய்சி டீடைல்ஸ் பேங்க் அக்கௌண்ட் நம்பர் ஐஎஃப்சி கோட் ஆதார் நம்பர் பேன் கார்டு நம்பர் அண்ட் ஷுட் பி வெரிஃபைடு பை யுவர் கரண்ட் எம்ப்ளாயர் UAN should be activated otherwise it would it take 3 days post activation to access the service as so step 1 go to epfo website uh, by clicking epo epo application step 2 go to the main menu and click on our services tab to access for employer employee services click on the tab it will de- redirect you to new page with services listed under for employee category step 3 click on one employee one epf account listed under the services section of the on for employer page step 4 fill the required details and generate otp which is delivered on your registered mobile number linked with the uan step 5 provide old epf id accept the declaration and submit the request linking of aadhar with the pf account through offline method epfo also provided the facility to link the aadhar number with the epf account of offline the epf has de- developed an aadhar linking application and the employee will have to fill the application form along with his uan and aadhar number with other required information the employee needs to attach self attested copies of the uan pan and aadhar with this form these documents need to be submitted at the field offices of epfo of common services centers csc at regional P- pf office once the verification is completed the aadhar number will be linked to epf account after that the employee will receive a message on his registered mobile number the main benefit of linking various pf accounts to your uan is to it will help you while to retirement you can withdraw the pf amounts immediately or when you apply for a loan you can immediately withdraw the amounts from the various accounts in the single account and also you can claim pf pension without any hurdle or hassle if you link your various P- pf accounts to your UA- uan and also linking aadhar linking aadhar with your uan will help you to withdraw your pf amount immediately without the intervention of your employer friends i think this information will be value valuable to you if you like this video please like it share it and please don't forget to subscribe my channel so that whenever i issue a new video it will come to you directly thanking you once again arvishegar practicing company secretary